The Bible tells us that the refiner of God takes God through a severe fire so that you can get the best product. So it's the same with our faith. When we are going through the valley of weeping, there is one area in our lives that is the enemy is targeting. Always the enemy is targeting your faith. Is targeting your faith. That's why he brings all these challenges. Hardships and trials, diseases, sicknesses, illness, problems, dead sea. And then you, you start asking yourself, where is my God? Let me tell you. God is with you in the valley of weeping. He said he will never forsake you. He will never leave us. But he allows all these things to come to us. To test our faith. My brother and my sister. The more your faith is tested, like a God going through the refinery, that God will come out pure. Your faith to come out pure and coming out as an overcomer, whether you like it or not, my faith, your faith, will be tested. Today, you may be on the top of the mountain, praising the Lord. Everything's going well. Oh, you are celebrating. You are talking so highly about your God. Oh, you are proud of Him. But let me tell you, brother, wait the day you get into the valley. That's why, that's why I want to share with you that when you get into the valley don't get stuck don't refuse to move on why the good shepherd is with you Jesus told us in John 27 that my sheep hear my voice. They hear my voice. And they know him. And they follow him. Let me tell you brothers and sisters. Jesus Christ is with you in the valley. And Jesus is going ahead of you. He is going ahead of you. He's the one who has gone through all the challenges of life. He's the one who went on the cross. And he suffered on your behalf. And he was buried. And on the third day, he rose again. 